G'day there, boys and girls. I hope you're having a wonderful day, and I hope you're ready for another of my favourite stories. Here we go. Today's story is by Anna Walker, and it's called Lottie and Walter. Nice and simple. Simple. I wonder which one's Lottie, which one's Walter. Hmm. Let's have a look. Lottie and Walter by Anna Walker. Lottie and Walter by Anna Walker. Lottie had a secret. Her mum didn't know the secret. And neither did her baby brother. Her swimming teacher definitely didn't know the secret. Only Lottie knew that a shark was hiding in the swimming pool. The shark didn't want to eat the other kids. It wanted to eat Lottie. Each Saturday morning, Lottie went to swimming class, watched, waited, put her shoes back on and went home again. Every week was the same. Next Saturday is the pool party, said Lottie's mum. You love parties, Lottie. Would the shark be at the party? Hmm. Lottie shivered. She looked down at the puddle under her flipper and in the reflection, Lottie saw something looking back at her. That was the moment Walter arrived. I don't want to swim next week. Lottie told Walter on the way home. Walter didn't answer. He was too busy singing. Humbly do, lumbly la, loopy loo. Lottie discovered that Walter loved books and bubbles. But he didn't love shampoo in his eyes. When fish fingers were served for dinner, Walter ate them all. It turns out they were his favourite, just like Lottie. At night time, when Lottie felt scared of the dark, Walter sang quietly. Humbly do, lumbly la, looby loo. And Lottie fell asleep. and dreamed of sailing the high seas. Lottie was so busy during the week, she forgot all about the swimming pool. But on Friday, while playing hide and seek, she began to feel uneasy. No one will find us in here, Lottie whispered. But they couldn't hide from Saturday. I'm not swimming, Lottie announced, and neither is Walter. Lottie didn't want to be eaten. Fair enough. Everyone was enjoying the pool party. Her mum, her brother, the swimming teacher, the children and the shark. Lottie listened to the water lap and gurgle. Then from deep in the shadows, she heard another sound. Humbly do. She moved closer to the edge. Lumbly la, loopy loo. 
Lily shuffled her flippers, looked down into the water and took a deep breath. Humbly do. Lottie had a new secret. There was no shark in the swimming pool. There were only children swimming and splashing. But now Lottie knew somewhere hiding and waiting for her. Was Walter. So that was Lottie and Walter by Anna Walker. I like that one. Thanks everyone. I hope you had fun. We'll see you next time. Bye.